Hi, welcome to our system here. We are on Arch Merged. And um, this tutorial is a tutorial on the response of a Facebook question I asked. Say guys, do you have anything else I should explain to you? And I said, look, uh, is it possible to have Compton as well on Mate? Because Mate is, is, has a great tool which is called Mate Tweak. And this Mate Tweak, we have here Windows and we can have here Marco or Marco Software Compositing or Marco Compton or in uh, the case of our scripts you have also Compis. So Compton is already installed and so you can take a look at, at uh, as of now. And um, let's open some stuff open so you see already the effect. This is now faded because it's not focused. When it's focused it's back opaque. And though this, these are the effects from Compton that we are used to in Arch Merge, the fading, going open slowly, the menus that are transparent, as well in programs and applications, these menus are transparent. So these are settings of a content.conf file. The question is, how do I do it? Okay, so it's possible. Control Alt T, and if you don't have the shortcut, you go to your terminal, and the first thing you do is you go back and minus S content, probably. Second thing I did was investigate what does Compton uh, give to us? What's, what is Compton? So you go inside here and visually you can just check quickly what does it provide. It provides us a configuration file and a configuration example. So that's the one we need. The second one, an application, Compton, Compton Trends, a desktop file, which is going to be user share applications. That's the folder where all the desktop files are so all your applications are in that folder some icons license and the manuals so basically if this is a very short list this is the one we need so let's put that up here i went to the home folder to the file system you just can type like in tunar etc but you have to click on the, the window and then etc and it, it instantly knows the directory so we don't need this one, we do need this one. So that's the one we want. So we copy that one and we put, go to Eric, so your home folder, Ctrl H, because in Arch Merge, maybe you've noticed as well, it's in the .conf file that we have this content conf file. But in this case, we are on Mate, meaning we have normally a different kind of uh, well, compositor. So Marco slash Compton.conf is and needs to be the name. So I copy paste this thing over to here and the only the thing I did was just rename it. So example is gone and Marco you put that in front. So it's actually just a simple copy paste of the standard configuration from Compton to your system to your dot config and that's it now it's up to you to decide what colors you want to change i mean what, what settings you want to change and all that there are lots of people figuring and tweaking the content conf you can get those from arch merch you can get, get those from from the net so let's give an example internet whoop, vivaldi let's have a look how do i do this first off and don't go using with Bing so I'm gonna kill this Bing thing once and for all so delete 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 delete, delete. you're gone so content.conf and the best thing is please share everything you have on github so we will find it as well and here are all the dots config uh, dot files of the content come from all kinds of people figuring out how to make it work and you can compare those LXTE content conf and so on so a lot of information I, I'm guessing let's have a look I'm guessing mine is there as well somewhere install personal settings content.conf this is from ultimate Linux 18.1 and if here is Altergos, for instance, or Arch i3, 
Antergos is closer, I think. And here you have code from some time ago. From from January 2017. So go and find your config code or start with this general one from here. And let's let's try it out and see if it actually works. So take a look at what happens now. I'm gonna refresh. Best thing is just to switch from no compositor. The best way to check if there is a compositor is a terminal. So the terminal is in my case uh, transparent. So no compositor means no transparency. Software comp compositor means okay. And this is the effect. But if we go then a little bit further, Compton, then this is the effect. Everything is now a little bit more transparent. Just the one that's focused is not transparent. So that's um, our Compton kicking in. And if you want to have Compton, there's your solution. It's not necessary, but you can experiment with it. Cheers.